I worked there for 20 years and I was a janitor, the person that cleaned all the floors. The building has six up levels of basement. The support companies for the cleaning of the World Trade Center was, were located on Big One. While I was there at 846, all of a sudden we hear boom, an explosion so hard that pushes us up. When I went to verbalize it, uh, like six seconds after, we hear that boom, that impact all the way on the top. So two different events. And at that very moment, when I, when I said, oh my God, a guy comes running into the office and <clears throat> this guy had his hands extended, both arms like this, and his skin was pulled totally from both arms, and it was hanging from the top of the fingertips like it was clothing. And I thought at that time that it was clothing. And when I went to say something, I realized, I look at his face, I realized that he had missing parts of his face. He had, on that particular day, the only master key. He went up with the master key, unlocking door after door so firemen could get in. And he himself, I think he said, brought out 15 or 20 people. So I started opening the doors of the stairwells so people could escape. Willie was made a hero and he was at the White House. And we have a picture of that, of George Bush honoring Willie Rodriguez for being a hero. We hear boom, 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 different explosions. And I asked the fire department, he said, what is this explosion? And what they said was, maybe it's the gas tank from the kitchen. No, the kitchens were all electrical. So that didn't make any sense. 